The Roman Emperor Marcus Aurelius has been one of the most profound thinkers the world has known. His views and ideas on life, which he used to record in his personal book, are relevant even today after 2000 years. Here is one of his quotes which might help us introspect our lives and evolve ourselves. Begin each day by telling yourself, Today I will be meeting people who are insensitive, rude, ungrateful, deceitful, cunning and selfish. And there is no point in being angry at them or hating them because the way they are is only because of their ignorance of what is right and wrong. As far as I am concerned, I will face everything that comes my way without losing my calm. You may think this is some kind of negative thinking. To anticipate that people are going to be rude, deceitful, unkind and ungrateful to us. But in fact, it is not. Just as we immune ourselves against various diseases and illnesses by taking the appropriate vaccination, the same way Marcus Aurelius believed we must immune ourselves against the insults and provocations of the world by mentally preparing ourselves against them. Because the behavior of other people is quite beyond our control, so it is very unreasonable for us to expect people to be the way we want them to be. Instead, it is much more practical to make ourselves such that we don't feel hurt or insulted by the behavior of other people. So, although we may not have control over the behavior of others, we do have control over how we should respond to their behavior. Some psychoanalysts say that since humans have evolved out of animals, the basic animal instincts of anger and violence are still deeply rooted in us. As Sigmund Freud puts it, civilization began the first time an angry human cast a word instead of a rock. So even though on the surface we may be civilized, but deep down we haven't evolved out of our animal nature. But once you realize that anger and violence are actually detrimental to your own health and well-being, you will make conscious effort to respond in any situation without being possessed by anger. After all, that is what makes us different from other animals that we have the choice or the freedom to not give in to our instincts. We end this segment with a quote of Victor Frank. Between the stimulus and your instinct to react, there is a small gap and in that gap lies your freedom to choose your response. Let us know how you found the video in the comments below. If you wish to remain updated with more of such videos, make sure you don't forget to click on the subscribe button. Thank you for watching.